video. Also, this video, I'm going to be reacting to Drake featuring Lotto, Housekeeping Nose. Um, so I was kind of surprised that this is a Lotto feature because I thought him and Nikki were close. But then when I thought about it, he's really close to 21 Savage and 21 Savage is rumored to be with Lotto. So I guess... I guess it kind of makes sense, and I don't think that Drake and Nicki have been close for a minute, or I don't really know what's going on with that. And wasn't Drake dating Lotto's sister, which is weird because she was like 21. I don't know if I didn't know, bro. Oh. Obviously, there was ties already. Obviously, they knew each other. So, I guess um, it's not that weird that they're making a song I don't know. It's just surprising to me. But anyways, um, I already reacted to his other song, It's Up, featuring Young Thug and um, 21 Savage. So if you're interested, go and check that out. But anyways, we're going to get into this. I've already said I am a Kendrick fan. Kendrick's my favorite rapper. But I will be honest, if this is good, it's good. I'm not about to lie. The fuck? I don't want to... It is what it is. I want to hear. Something sweet. Something uplifting. Something um, sweet and uplifting, huh? Yeah. Play something inspiring. I did I did see like little um what was it I saw memes that were like I guess he does run to Atlanta when he needs a dollar Ew, that was funny but then I was like is he trolling the shit I don't fucking know I don't know what is going on to be completely honest ride, 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 yeah. Look, I can't get no eight hours of sleep now when you hear laying next to me like the third time switching out the sheets housekeeper must know that we some freeze yeah, um i'm not fucking with this right now as of yet i'm gonna be real i don't like that e I, I, I don't like that how that sounds personally maybe it's about to change i don't fucking know but this ain't my favorite so. time switching out the sheets housekeeper must know that we some freeze when you go away, I hate the distance. Booking flights like I was your assistant. I could never treat you like no mistress. But if I fuck you like you all, then what's the difference? Popping ass and popping pills. West Coast girls do the same, but in the hills. South side girls, they know how to close a deal. Up in the six, all up in the six, up in the six, they do whatever they feel. I done had too many drinks to hop behind the wheel. Crack it out, parking, and I'm carrying concealed. No, you see it poking out, I never miss no meal. The unfortunate part is the my like famous favorite part of the song thus far is the ride, 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 ride that part. And even when Drake's voice behind that like kind of 
like going off of that um even when lotto did it that was my favorite part but as far as like the verses and whatever it's not like it's not a terrible song but it's like just not like doing what it needs to do for me personally maybe i'm tweaking but yeah not doing what it needs to do for me personally and i think i'm just like i think especially after this beef like drake's almost 38 and i feel like i've want like it don't always need to be like that but I want some mature raps something vulnerable something even being transparent and uh, um um about the whole situation that he just went through being real about it like it just seems like the content is the same kind of stuff that like 25 year olds are rapping about 20 year olds are rapping about I don't know. I, I don't know. It's not like, and I get sick of like certain rappers, certain female rappers rapping about they coochie all the day, all day and talking about they going to take this girl, be, uh, nigga and do this and that. And men talking about they going to do money sex and all that. So, you know, drugs and stuff like that. So I get tired of the repetitive shit and I just wish he could kind of just be like vulnerable and open for like one song at least Jesus Christ this is the part I like <laughs> not my favorite not gonna lie I like the other one I listened to way more um and like I said I feel like this is like a testing the water type of thing seeing what kind of feedback he gets um yeah I feel like he's just trying to see what type of feedback he gets um so that he can I guess move from there and decide what he's gonna do moving forward if he's gonna rap or if he's gonna go more into like a singing melodic thing or whatever I don't know but like I said I just wish like the Subject content would like switch up a little bit. Like, what is it? Churchill Downs with Jack Carlo. I, that was a really strong verse from Drake. Like, I really, really appreciated it. And it was minimal. I'm popping pills and I'm fucking bitches and yo bitch and that bitch and this bitch. And I got more money than every. Well, he did say that a couple of times, but it was a different type of vibe and a different type of, I think, message. And I would just wish, like I said, he would switch it up a little bit, especially because he's getting older. You can even hear like how older rappers rap now versus like their stuff like Nas and Jay-Z, like just compare it. It's a different level. It's more like suave businessmen. Like they got their shit together. Even like if we say J. Cole and Kendrick, I feel like. Sometimes, yeah, it's like a like a hit, but also sometimes it's just like I'm depressed as fuck and this and this happened to me and damn, this is a struggle that I have and I'm insecure and all that. Like just being real, just being real and honest. And I feel like Drake is like just trying to look like he's unbothered and tough and all that stuff that he's missing the fucking point and opportunity. I feel like this is giving him to just be to open up a different side of himself, but you know, he's probably not going to take it. So whatever. We're just going to have more party music. <laughs> so fun. Whatever. Anyway, it wasn't a terrible song. It wasn't my favorite though. So y'all like, comment, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram. Follow me on TikTok. I'll see y'all in the next one.